Welcome to the Windows and Computer Channel, and uh, interesting, we uh, always talked about, and some of you have asked about, Universal Windows Platform. This is something that when, you know, Windows 10 arrived, they were actually thinking that everything would be Universal Windows Platform, and there were some apps that were done, but then at some point we noticed that there was not a lot of apps, and there was not a lot of businesses or companies that would do software in UWP. And Microsoft did one, which was the Skype app. And, uh, well, we it's still not announced, but according to some bloggers, including Paul Tarot, and um, some information that it was scooped up from some of the uh, different um, informational uh, text that Microsoft sent out, it would seem that Universal Windows Platform Skype app would be killed and of course uh, that means we will go back if you're using Skype we would go back to the desktop version you know I use Skype from time to time I don't use it a lot but I do use it from time to time and I've always used the desktop one because the one that's integrated into Windows 10 for some reason I've always found to be I don't know buggier or it, it's just weird and you know I I always downloaded the desktop version. What is also interesting is the fact that they offered the desktop version alongside the Universal Windows Platform version that, by the way, was already pre-installed on your Windows 10 machines. So this is kind of weird, kind of almost acknowledging that, well, you know, we'll keep the other one just in case, um, <laughs> which, you know, they should have if they really wanted this to work, they should have uh, said, well, okay, here's the uh, UWP version, and Windows 10 won't have a desktop version anymore. But they never did that. And I think it's part of, partly they realized, yeah, maybe uh, maybe we should not kill the other version, just in case. Well, starting soon, apparently, we're going to be back here. And it, of course, brings back, once again, Universal Windows Platform, and um, uh, universal web apps, all of that, you know, what's happening. Um, you know, the universal web apps, these are going to continue probably because um, a lot of companies are committed to that because it has a way of being uniform across all operating systems and browsers. But the universal Windows platform, I think, is pretty much dead. And Microsoft should maybe focus on some other, um, you know, good old ways of having apps on Windows, like before. I think this is, you know, it, it was an idea that, that they tried and uh, doesn't seem to work well. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thanks for watching.